Okay, guys. This uh, video is for those who have uh, commercial network services, VPS, and are having issues getting it to work or getting it set up. It, they'll send you your email telling you how to sign in. And once you sign in, you go to commercial network services here and you sign in to your account. Okay, right here, you just sign in, and you'll see this page here or something similar. And when you see this, you go to My Products and Services. This is, and then you hit View Details. Okay, you'll get this little page that comes up here telling you about your your server and I know Windows 2012 looks a little different uh, than 2008 but it should look very similar to this okay just come down here and if you have multiple monitors you have it span monitors or you can have it just go full size okay They'll be on one monitor. Color depth. Have a high speed broadband. Make sure that's checked. And right here, you download this. Download Open RDP shortcut. And what I do is I put it on my desktop. So you hit save to your desktop. We got one there, but save it to your desktop I know you can download they have uh, apps you can download that uh, I think it says somewhere down here I don't have the two-factor auth authentication on mine but you can go down here somewhere there's a uh, add-on there's, there's a software you can download I don't use that this is the only, only thing I use Let's see, see right here it says physical memory free. I got 205 megs available. Uh, Uptown. Uh, you will need to, they'll send you a, a password in your email. I'm not sure if this reset password here is working yet. If it is, you can click that, click on that. Because in order to get here, you'll have to use the email they sent you in your email. The password they sent you in your email. Uh, then, when I got mine, this portion was not working. I don't know if they've got it working or not. But if so, you can change your password to your uh, to the VPS. So anyway, we got that downloaded. Let me uh, close VPS I have open now. Okay. So once you got that, um, you go to your desktop and you find this little icon here. It says VM RDP. Double click on it. It'll ask you all this. You type in your password. And it connects. And then you're able to do whatever you want on your the platforms. In order to put a uh, your your auto trader on here, the way I do it is I just go to File, hit Open Data Folder. Okay, when you open your data folder here, you can see all of these other these are hard drives from your main computer. The local one is your server hard drive. 
all these other ones are on your main computer. Uh, you just click on your and then uh, you just browse to wherever you download it. The uh, your uh, MT4 uh, install. Let's say if you download it into your downloads folder, just go to users and whatever name of your computer then downloads and it will be in look in there and all you have to do you don't have to drag it over to your server or anything you just click on it and tell it to install and it'll install on the server and once your uh, platform is installed then you go wherever you downloaded your auto trader. See, I think I have it on my desktop here. Um, maybe not. Where? Okay. Say this was the. This is the old one, but just browse to wherever you downloaded it to. Right click. Hit copy. Then all you have to do is go back to your platform. So you just look up here, just keep hitting back until you get back to this screen here. Left double click on MQL4, experts, then right click and paste inside. of your experts folder and you just do that with um, ever how many platforms you install on your uh, on your VPS hope this helps if you guys have any questions feel free to uh, talk to me in the chat have a good day